has a road to travel to become a man. My road started here. At 12,000 feet, it is the highest capital in the world. La Paz, Bolivia is not for the faint of heart. It is the poorest country in South America, but the richest in indigenous culture. With over 65 to 75% of its people being indigenous to this area. sometimes neglected children of this country. This road took me to hospitals, to orphanages, and to schools, where I saw children that just wanted to live as children, but the harshness of their situation forced them to be made men and women at young ages. I myself never needed or wanted for anything. I had a privileged life, but after I saw brothers and sisters, not over 10 years old, sleeping on boxes without food, a mother or a father, or shelter, I broke down and cried, and asked God to forgive me for my selfishness. I decided that day to give up my life for these children so that they could have a better one. My parents gave so much to others, but kept little for themselves, and I will take their mantle and go further. Being a man is realizing responsibility and accepting the burdens placed in your heart by God and giving up your own selfish pleasures. On this road, I was humbled by God I saw the magnificence of untouched creation, mountains and lakes that have existed for thousands of years without the human touch. Lake Titicaca, the highest navigable lake in the world, is a sacred place for these people, and they believe it has supernatural forces. I've been on four continents, 43 states, seen the Colosseum and the Swiss Alps, floated the streets of Venice, walked the second largest city in Asia, and stood atop the World Trade Center. But I made this journey, plain road, boat, and foot, 